Oh, we we're so close. Oh. No. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. 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 Dang it. <laughs> oh, man. Dang it. A vanilla raptor. What's going on guys, TBF Gaming, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Evolved. We're jumping back into Center Eternal. Really excited to get going today. We've got a couple things planned out. First things first, we're finally working on our breeding. I got a whole bunch of stuff done inside the base. But before I do that, I do want to show you this. Spike left a comment in one of the last videos that talked about I should add a sign that says days without incident and have a number up there. I'm going to have to figure out how to get the number a little bit bigger. That zero is way too small, but there you go. Days without incident sign. Uh, it is zero because I literally just died. Is my body still out here? Let me see. My body was here somewhere. I think Otto ate it when he came by. Uh, just the eternal grace didn't activate, so we flew. It died. We're also going to add another sign that's going to be total deaths. Let's do that right now because I do have the sign already. I put it all the way against the wall just so I could uh, place the little sign on top of it. I don't really like how it looks. I might move it back out, but we'll see. We'll figure all that out. Let's move out just a little bit. There we go. And then total deaths. I've actually been keeping a tally of all my deaths. And I'll show you guys that either later today or uh, maybe 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 at the end of this episode, maybe the next episode. Uh, but you'll, you'll see it up there. It is definitely three digits. That's just number signs right there. But I'll definitely show you guys that here pretty soon. Really excited to show you that. But here, here's what we're going today. We are doing a little bit of breeding. We're going to go out and tame something fun here in a minute. But we're doing breeding inside of here. I've got Spot down here doing a little bit of breeding, the 936, along with a... 150 mail because that was my highest mail currently now there is potions within the eternal mod that can switch the gender of it So there'll be the male female can flip but until we get a little bit higher ones It's, it's just gonna be this way, but we're kind of hoping for like mutations and stuff anyway So we don't really care as much about the level early on or honestly ever really and then we still want to get the fire hyena dawn the alpha hyena dawn and the prime hyena dawn eventually and then here's the poisons over here doing their thing a few more minutes so They'll be breeding again. We got the nanny put out right here I've got the Eternal Generator, so we got power. Auto made that for us. I can't make it until level 85, and we are only level 84. Oh, we're close, though. But 85, you got to be able to make that. So Auto made that for us, dropped us on, dropped it off here, and put the fuel on it for us. Thank you, Auto. And then we've got our Dino Storage, which automatically collects the babies when they're born. Uh, so as long as there's not more than 41 of them, let's go like that. There we go, a few more. So the next 58 babies will get picked up on here. Oh, we got a few new ones right here. Let's check these out. Let's check out the new babies. We got one two three oh look at that 712 that's a good level right there that's really good okay cool so they're gonna do their thing i do need to get some meat on here i didn't grab meat yet so let's go like this and let's look at all the meats go raw meat i'm gonna pull a bunch over here and then let's go berry we'll pull a whole bunch of those over here there we go all right, and the eternal feeder should take care of everyone else. We just need her to feed them when they're little tiny babies. Uh, so the prehistoric mod actually added an up update where the doors open automatically now. I do love it, but I wish that there was a way to enable where they don't open automatically uh, to where you can like shut it off if you want to, just like the S Plus doors. I assume it's going to come in a later update, but still really, really cool. Uh, we got that recently. In the last episodes, we got a terror bird along with the adventurers, and then we went out and got an iguanodon and that really cool... Uh, what is this thing called? The, uh, oh, whatchamacallit, the Elite Dragonfly. So now as we get a little bit further into the season, I will do like an episode where we actually just go over the entire uh, Airbender stuff. There is a way, like if you're admin on your server, you can have all of the ad the Airbender powers. And I think it allows for one avatar on the server at a time, unless you're an admin, then you can have it uh, constantly. But yeah, that's what we got going today. I do want to go out and see what we can tame. So we've done a trip to the Redwood. We've had a couple adventures now to the Redwood, and that was a lot of fun. But I think what we need to do now, I just love flying around with this. It's so much fun. And as long as the Eternal Grace is on down there in the bottom, we don't take fall damage, so it's amazing. All right, but yeah, we've done the Redwood a couple times. I think we're good there right now. We could probably still go get a bunch more animals from there, and we have to look for the Hyenodons there eventually. But I think it's time to maybe go a little bit more into the cold region. What do you guys think? I think we'll go over there to the cold area, see if we can tame something kind of fun. So I have a little bit of arrows, not much arrows, but let's do this. Oh, oh, dang it. Flight, there you go. Okay, oh, stop, stop. We're still learning. We're still figuring out the flight. So I want to take this guy, 
And we are going to evolve this guy eventually. We need a special thing to actually evolve him. We'll get that going here eventually. So let's go ahead and go like this. I do want to look at the pikes to see if I can make a better pike. I don't think I can yet. Let's see. Pike. So there's a few different ones. We have the poison pike, which is what we have. The alpha poison pike, which takes five of these pikes. Okay. And then that one takes ten of the other pikes. So can I make five of these? How expensive are they? Oh, they're not expensive at all. We just make a bunch of pikes. Okay. Well, let's do this. Let's get ourselves a better pike, and we're going to go pike things. All right. Let's go like this. So I think I have enough to make. I'm going to need five, ten. What is it? I'm going to need a lot. Let's go like 55. Oh, no, no. What are we doing? Pike. Pike. I need to make like, let's start with 20 and we'll work from there. Okay. So that's going because you just need a few of these for the first one. It's going to be super heavy. I don't know how many we can carry. Okay, so we'll take this up. We'll make a few of the regular pikes, turn those to alpha pikes, and I'll figure out exactly what I need. I didn't really math it out. Uh, let's see. Put all those over there. And then we go like this. Pike. So now we can make ten of those. All right. And I need two of these. Okay. So I need eight more. So, wow. <laughs> okay. So I need five of those. And I need eight. So eight times five, 40. I need 40 pikes. Whoa, okay. So 40 pikes. I think I had the metal for it because we've been taking out our Anki out there and getting all kinds of stuff. So it shouldn't be too bad. Here, how many do we have here? There's another 10. All right. I'm going to need 30 more. Oh, that's so many. Now you get these from drops. Let's make sure I don't have some from drops before I make a bunch. Let's see. Pike. Uh, oh, I have one of those. That'll cut down a little bit. All right. So that is it, though. All right. Let's make 29 more. Okay. So 29 more pikes. And this it's going to be worth it because these things are fairly strong. Oh, my God. We actually have it. Okay. And then we can just pull it up. We don't have to sit there and do this by hand. I was just doing it so we can figure out the math for it. There we go. I know I usually skip through this stuff, but I want to show you this stuff because this pike is definitely worth it. All right. Let's go like that. Let's put all these over here. Oh, and we got one on our inventory. There we go. All right, pike. Let's go ahead and make 10 more of those, which gives us two more of those. Oh, we're getting closer, guys. We're getting closer. Let's go ahead and test this one out. While we're at it real quick, we'll test that one out. All right, so it's an alpha poison pike. Oh, man, we're going to be so close. All right, so let's go like this. So 30. Got him. Okay. Look at that. That's crazy. All right. And then we'll do those. And then, oh my God, we're only one short. Okay, hold on. So I need, we're going to need at least three more pikes. Okay, three more. Or probably eight more. We're so close. This is a long process. It's fairly expensive, but with all the stuff that we have, we're good to go. All right. Let's make like 11 more just to be safe. Yeah, because we've been taking these guys. If you guys don't know about the Eternal Doad and the Anki. Oh, we did get a name for you. Hold on. We got a few names that we do got to give out today, too. I'll make sure I give those out by the end of the episode. We got a lot of good names. I really appreciate the names. Uh, it definitely helps out. Let's go up here. All right. So let's go Pike action. Okay. Like that. There we go. Two more of those. Oh, my God. We got it. Yes. So there we go. We got one of the big time ones and one of the small ones so we can test. It is science time, guys. Let's go science this out. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Uh, can we do a pike off of you? Because you're an alpha. That's not too bad. Let's see. We can. But I'm a little afraid if we use you that something bad is going to happen. Let's, let's go like this so we can fly a little bit and we'll do a lot of stuff on foot real quick. Oh, can we make a dino tracker so we don't lose you? All right, let's go tracker like that. Yes, we can. I need to just make a bunch of these. Let's make a few. There we go. Yes, there we go. All right, Blaze. Now we can't lose Blaze as easy, at least. This pike should be amazing, hopefully. 
All right, bunch of owl action. <gasps> a rhino. That'd be that'd be amazing, right? But I, I don't want to jump into the prime tier just yet. I still want to work on some of the alphas. I would love to get an alpha rex because I actually have an alpha rex tamed up. Oh, man, we are so far into the video. Guys, I forgot to tell you. If you guys enjoy the video, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Leave a comment down below. I really appreciate it, guys. Make sure you guys do that. Let's get back into it. Okay. Had to do a quick advert. All right, let's see. Because so, we got a UD back at the base. I'm not worried about a UD. But I would love to get myself a Rex. I saw Taru has a Rex. I'm a little bit jealous. I would like my own. So we will go Rex hunting. Uh, but if not, if, if we find, honestly, anything that's worthwhile, we will go for it. There we go. It's always so hard to see with this guy. What is that? Oh, a Ghost Rex. What's up, man? So I know we were talking about a couple episodes ago, the uh, Ghost Rex. Look at this guy. We got eaten by the Ghost Saber recently. Not quite the same thing, but very similar. Oh, here's another crazy thing. Look at this. What are you? That is the Spectral Yudi. Very cool. All right. The search continues. Let me find... Oh, here we go. We haven't done one of these guys yet. Oh, you're low level, though. <gasps> Eternal Alpha Terror Bird. Oh, this is it. Okay, here we go. Hold on. Because we already have one. We could definitely get another. All right, let's get the good pike. All right, passive. Here we go, here we go. Ready? Bam! Oh! Oh, that was quick. For some reason, I thought I would... Why didn't I bowl a hit? What were we doing? All right. So the challenge of the season is to see if this sign ever gets... Uh oh Oh, no. That was weird. But yeah, the challenge is going to be to see if this sign ever me even makes it to day two. Because right now it's going to be day one constantly. <laughs> so, all right, hold on. Let's, uh, let's get our stuff back. Let's retrieve. Let's get our owl back. Dang, that was not our best moment. Bam! Blaze. I'm glad you're okay. All right, let me meet you guys back out there. All right, so this did some pretty amazing tour board. Look at that, 477, 478. Let's see if we can hit him one more time. Hold on, hold on. Come on. Did I hit him? Yeah, we got him, we got him. Go down, dude. Yeah, it worked. Uh, well, we didn't really think this through. I don't have the meats yet. <laughs> well, I got a few, I got a few, but do I want to use them on a terror bird? I don't. It's a 600, though. What do we do? Let me see if Otto wants it. I'll be right back, guys. All right, so Otto was nice enough to send the snake. <laughs> Otto knows I'm deathly afraid of snakes, so thanks for that, Otto. <laughs> Absolutely wrong. But anyway, yeah, we, we let Otto know because Otto has a really good level of these guys. He can add it to his little breeding program over there. Very, very cool. All right, let's move on. Was oh, that Alpha Mantis? Oh, that'd be fun. Alpha Mantis? It's a 600. Totally do it. I just have to lose this dang. Oh man, I almost flew down to our old base. I don't want to break everything. Dun, 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 dun. It, don't, it just came back up, man. I know. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna try something else here, see if I can do it without dying. <laughs> you got this. I'm doing, it, I'm doing it on foot. I'm using a uh, 600. Is a 600 uh, robot stego I want. Poke in the butt. Poke in the butt. Oh, the madness is out. Madness is out. Yes. Oh, if this saber's biting it. I don't think it did. I think it was biting the dodo. Three prime meat. I think I still had that little bit of meat left when you gave it to me. I hope. Yes. I was say I have plenty, so if 
you need more. Nope, one hundred percent effectiveness, six, level six hundred Alpha Mantis. I'm good with this. That's awesome, dude. That is a great mid tier situation going on right there. <laughs> Crystal pick or crystal hatchet in its hands. Mm. Oh, that thing is a beast. <laughs> oh, he's teased me. He's not eating. Why would you do this? Ow. What are you going after that uh, robot, robot stego right now? Yeah. On foot with a pike. You got this. I yep, it's at, it's at 2.8 million of 6.9 million torpor. <laughs> oh man. So, so like two more bites. So, yeah. I don't know how much I do. Oh, you were right about the pike though. That pike is amazing. Pikes are the, beautiful. The, the prime poison pike is, you can knock out almost everything. All right, guys, there we go. We got our super amazing mantis. Check this out. Where is he at? Alpha mantis. Throw him down. The pike that we had was amazing. So we'll go ahead and throw a saddle on this guy. Let's get a saddle. Hopefully it's just a regular mantis saddle. I'm not actually sure. Let's see. Mantis. Manti. Mantis. Elemental. Elemental fire. Alpha. Okay, it's an actual alpha mantis. I hope I have the stuff for it. If not, we might have to go eat some things. Let's see. All right. Mantis saddle. We got it. All right, sweet. There we go. And we already borrowed a pick and a hatchet from Otto. It's this crystal hatchet and crystal crystal pick. We're struggling with words. So the pick, the hatchet, these things are absolutely amazing. They gather all the stuff. We're going to put it on the actual mantis. And I'll show you this. Check it out. So let's go like that, like that. And then we take this put, and we'll put it on him just a second. Let's see what he does first. All right, let's go see. Yeah, man. Oh, we need a picture before we do anything. Well, it's not raining. Hurry, hurry. Okay, let's go. We had to get a couple pictures of it real quick. Got a K mode. All right, probably not the prime UD, but pretty much anything else we can probably mess with real quick here. I would like to get ourselves a couple levels, make them a little bit faster. Oh, we got some lag going. That's not good. Uh oh. <laughs> We're stuck in like forever mode here. Oh, this is a bad spot. <laughs> let's get out of here. Oh, come on. Get out. What level is that guy? It's an elemental Rex. Let's see. I would not mind an elemental Rex if he's a good level. Ah, uh, 200. Never mind. Oh, what's this? How about you? A 580 Raptor. Look at this guy. Hold on, hold on. Oh, can we put a poison pick in his hand? <gasps> what do you even think about this? Let's see. Let's go like this. All right, hold on, hold on. Poison pick. Poison pick. Oh, my God, guys. This is about to be crazy. No. Is it in his hand? I don't know. Did it do torpor? It did. Oh, it did torpor. Okay, this is the most amazing thing ever. I don't even want to pump melee anymore. Now we're just going to go for it. All right. Let's see if we can knock everybody out. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, let me catch you. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Eat these guys. Oh, man. All right, let's go test some things out. Sorry, we were, we were geeking out. We had to put it in chat. I was super excited. Oh, no. <laughs> He's got 37 million torpor. That's fine. Let's, uh, okay, do your thing. Come on. All right, hold on. You stay right there. I do want to. Oh, no. Is he coming back? Are you coming back or are you running? What is he doing? Oh, he is. He is. Okay, fight everybody. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Let's get him out of there. I'm not losing my guy day one here. Okay, got it. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, he's right behind me. <laughs> I want that alpha raptor. We're going to go for it in just a second. Hold on. How much do you have? Oh, you're about to go to sleep. We can just hit him like one time. Here we go. Oh, no, he's running? Okay. Oh, we missed. Oh, no, we hit him. Wow. There we go. He's out. I'm not going to tame him. I just wanted to make sure he doesn't come back and eat us. All right, so this guy needs two prime meat. One, two. Yeah, there we go. The good stuff, man. Get this guy. Nice, man. Alpha Raptor, Alpha Mantis. This is a great day. Let's continue with the Mantis. All right, where's my Mantis? Plus, I want to see. The stuff that he has in his hand, does it stay? Oh, oh. 
Still got the effect. Okay. Let me see. Okay, so the pike stays in his hand. Good, good. All right, ride. Okay, once he's done with all that. Yeah, I don't even want to... We definitely don't want to pump his melee too much because we want to be able to knock things out now. This is pretty amazing, actually. I wonder what other... We've got to figure out what other creatures can actually hold one of these. There we go. How much torpor does it do? 130, and it builds up. So 219, 264. 400. We're at 400,000. So just short of 500,000. That's amazing. Let's go knock everything out. <laughs> That's pretty good, man. Pretty good. Plus, the Mantis is decently powerful. Also, we want to do this. Hold on. Up on top of here, there's some pretty good gathering places. Let's go gather. What are you? Eternal Alpha Pegasus. Where are you going? It's a passive tame. What is he doing? Okay, you still doing things? What are you doing? Let's see if he calms down. If we get three alphas today, that'd be amazing. Oh, we shouldn't press our luck, should we? Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to get rid of it for you. There you go. Alright. There we go. Let's do this. Hold on. Let's put a tracker on you so I don't lose you. Okay, are you going to come back down? We can put an eternal berry over here. It'd be a super easy tame if he comes down for us. There's another one over there too. What is that? A fire pegasus. Now, think we can fly next to him and do this? Let's find out. There we go. Oh, we almost got it. Come on, come on. Oh, we almost got it. We're going to do it. I'm telling you. I saw the E to press the button. We just didn't get it in time. All right, here we go. Air taming. Let's do this. Well, maybe, unless he comes down to us. Come on, man. I want to get this tame. All right, ready? Go. Go, 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 go. Oh, we're so close. There you go. Come on. Oh, we're so close. Oh. No. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. 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 Dang it. <laughs> Oh, man. Dang it. A vanilla raptor. All right. Let's see. <laughs> uh, we can spawn pretty close, but we got to get our stuff. Let's go all the way back. All right, guys. We're back over here. Let's see if we can get this guy. Oh, if he comes down to us, then I'll have to fly around. I was hoping to get a cool tame where we fly to him. Oh, it didn't tame all the way. Well, I guess we get a chance to do the air tame. How fast is it going to be in between feedings? We just got to test it out. Oh, no, he got mad. <laughs> oh, he's mad. No, he's mad. <laughs> now it didn't work out. We're adding numbers to the death count today. All right, looks like he's done being mad. Come on, let me feed you. Come on, come on. Come on, ride him. Oh, I don't know. How, how do you know when he's doing his little thing? I don't actually know. I've never tamed one of these guys in the air. Do they still do the same little, like, the little hee-haw thing? I don't know. We'll know in a minute. Patience. We're really good at patience. We got this. Uh, the good thing is, <laughs> if you don't get it, you die because you're so high in the air. This is crazy. Okay, come on. Do the thing. Oh, my guy's going to fly us out of the map. Please don't fly out of the map. Where are you going, man? Oh my god, he's going to get us out of the entire map here. Oh my god, he just killed me through the roof of the whole game. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang it. Oh, if we just lost everything, I'd be really upset. What all was on my inventory at that point? Alright, hold on. Let's... I can't even go back to base. Let's go to auto's base real quick. Dang. If he uh if we lost everything on our inventory, I'm gonna be really bummed. Hold on, we do have a we've got a base over here. Or we got a thing over here. Let's see if it works. Nothing. Oh my god. We just lost all of that stuff. 
Uh, what else was on my inventory? I don't even know. We're going to have to go back and look. Uh, that was bad. Uh, okay. All right. Well, let me go back and get the mantis, and then we'll kind of figure things out from there. All right. Luckily, the mantis was not on our inventory. Thank goodness. So we didn't lose him. Uh, but we did lose the raptor and whatever else was on our inventory, uh, gear, stuff like that. Not too big of a deal. Uh, we do got to add three deaths to the counter, so that's going to be up to 140. Days without incident, still zero. I don't know if that's ever going to hit one, guys. I really don't know. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for today. This guy's going to be amazing. The other thing I did want to show you was his gathering. I guess we could do that real quick before we end it. Let's do that because I do want to show you what he can do with some metal nodes. Check this out. Oh, wait. I don't have a crystal anymore. Never mind. I can't show you that because I don't have a crystal hatchet or crystal pick anymore. So that will not be a thing in today's episode. We'll have to wait for the next episode. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. I'm having a good time <laughs> with all the disasters. That actually makes it more fun, honestly. Anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed it. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Leave a comment down below. All those kind of things. You guys are awesome and amazing. I will see you in the next video. It is indeed a thing. Thanks, guys.